hello friends one of these sub channel subscriber has asked me what is the uh, like difference between the no lock and read past query hints i already the, uh, answered the question here okay you can get it from here as well but uh, since it is very simple so i thought that i also have some free time i can explain in easy way so here i am creating one table in the master database okay the, uh, now i am inserting 10 rows okay now i am opening a statement i am trying to update one employee name where a name is name is equal to john something else i am updating with the john updated where id is equal to one i have not yet committed i have not yet committed okay so i am taking another session here i am trying to execute that if this execute what will happen it will go in the blocking state see it will go unlimited blocking time okay so that's the reason i am cancelling this query now i want to try the data here see here now if i click that i used to get the data updated data as yes, this data is not yet committed so this data we call it as a dirty read okay so we are executing the data but we are getting the dirty data and we are not getting blocked this is the first thing for example i want to view all the names or all the counts or like uh, some types like uh, we have a, like bus transport system like we need to know what are the person's names or how many count of the employees for this data happen if i do the count start from employee it will get blocked so here we don't we require some count value so at that time uh, so like you can go with the no lock query hint like this all depends upon the uh, customer requirement and business justification so you, once you know particular use okay once you want re uh, requirement comes so they can uh, use this uh, like whatever query hint you like again you can discuss with them based on their uh, output or wish and you can employ with that okay so as of now like i used to get this data john Do it is the name but uh, what we are getting john updated we are getting so since so we are getting the dirty data but we are getting exact count okay exact count and like um, so this is the thing so i have not yet done like uh, i mean to say like uh, i have not yet committed okay i have not yet come to this data now what i am doing i am trying to execute another statement with the this, this only this is done now i have blocked uh, like uh, where id is equal to 2 now now this is also in locked state and this is also in locked state with by same transaction okay so now what will happen now if i do that so if i do this see the two locked rows has been skipped and it is giving the read results it means so if i try to execute this both query hints in the when you were you use no lock query hint we are getting all the records but some data will be like um, dirty reads okay when i use the read past the law the rows which are locked by another session has been skipped and we are getting the uh, remaining data so this is the difference between no lock and read past so this is how you can answer and whenever uh, we say the customer interviewer might ask which one you use so this all depends upon these scenarios okay you just know what it does okay i hope uh, you might know exact the difference now thank you bye